Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel, Dream It, Make It. Today, we are showing a new product. And uh, if you're coming over from the previous video and uh, you saw where I revealed this, or you haven't seen the video where I revealed this, at the end of this one, go check that one out. Go check out this one. But if you're coming over from that video, thanks for coming to the next video. In this one, we are talking about this Inkbird ISC 007 BW. It's got a super duper long name, but I'm super pumped about this one. And what it does is it essentially turns in, turns, you know, like your drum smokers or your eggs or, you know, all these things that have charcoal in the bottom of them. And then you light it, slowly burns, you put some wood chunks in it and it's got a lid and it just holds temperatures for a long time. This thing right here is going to manage that for you. That way you don't have to do anything. Essentially it turns it into like a pellet smoker. And I have the Oklahoma Joe's Bronco. And let me tell you up front, I've seen so many people put this on the Oklahoma Joe's Bronco, post pictures, post videos about it. And all this time I've thought, you don't need that with the Bronco. It holds temp. You set it and you can forget it. Uh, don't believe me, I have a video, link above, 17 hours. I set it and it ran for 17 hours and was constant, like unbelievably constant. I didn't do anything. After about the first hour on the Bronco, you've got it dialed in and you don't have to do anything else. It just runs itself. But with that being said, what's really cool, what I do love is it does turn the Bronco into pretty much a pellet smoker. And that means I can light it up in the morning, throw this on it, it's gonna regulate my temperatures for me. I can go to work, be at work all day. I can see the temperature of the meat. I can see the temperature of the drum. And if I see that it's not gonna be done in time when I'm coming home, I can bump that temp up. With the Bronco, I can't do that. I can set it and I can go to work and I can come home and it'll be right there waiting for me at the same temperature when I get back most of the time. I've only had it not do that a few times, most of the time. That's what it does, and it, it just runs like a champ. But this is gonna take things to a whole nother level, make things a little easier as far as being away from the smoker. But that isn't the reason why I got this. That is not the reason why this excites me, and I'll talk about that reason here in a little bit. Okay, let's get it open. Let's check it out. So. I've got it open. Comes with this hose, right? This hose goes into the device, then it goes down the tube of the Bronco. It doesn't actually connect to the Bronco with uh, out making some modifications. We're gonna be doing that. I'm gonna do a video on that and how to modify this for the Bronco. So again, if you haven't liked and or you haven't subscribed to this channel, I suggest doing that. I'm gonna be showing all of that in some future videos. Comes with the thermometers, all the thermometers that you need to run this thing and check on your meat and see your ambient temperature. It's got it right there. But I know you just want to see the device. And some of you have probably already seen this before, but here it is. I'm going to come around here. Here's the device right there. This right here is awesome. Connects to Wi Fi. Um, I can't wait. If, if you haven't seen the other video where Inkbird released the very first 5G thermometer, they have. It's awesome. I've been using it. It's pretty sweet. This one is not 5G. It's older. Uh, it's been out for a while. Uh, Inkbird, I'm really looking forward to a 5G one of these because 5G is just better. Um, but they have this and I've heard really good things about it and I'm looking forward to using it. So, now that you've seen it up close, this thing is 
going to be pretty sweet. Like I said, it's got that. Um, it's got the plates for like if you have the uh, what are those? The big green eggs or the acorns or I don't know. I'm a I'm an Oklahoma Joe guy, but they have these little things. They stick in them and it pops right on, nice and easy for setup. We've got some adjustments to make for the Bronco. It's also got the power cord and it's got another little adapter in here for probably the smaller versions of those eggs and then what else i think that's it it's got some other plates other little adapters all which won't serve any purpose on my oklahoma joe bronco but now that we've seen it all we've talked about some things let's get this thing shut back up so i don't dump it over off the table so why am I excited about this thing? I'm excited about this thing because I've been wondering if I could turn my Oklahoma Joe's Bronco into a warmer. Meaning I cook a brisket on my offset or I could cook it on the Bronco, but it's probably gonna be on the offset. Cook a brisket on the offset, pull it off and I wanna hold it. And I wanna hold it for like 12 hours, you know, that super long rest time that all the uh, top spots in Texas are doing. And to do that, you need a warmer. And I have like a warmer that can do it, but I wanna know if the Bronco can do it. And so that is going to be the very first video with this product. Can the Bronco turn into a warmer? and hold temps. This says it can get as low as 160. Now, I know, I know, 160. I'm gonna try to mess with this and see if we can actually get it down to the 150 mark. Uh, I would really love to be able to get it to like 145. I don't know, We're gonna, like I said, we're gonna try some stuff out. We're gonna see if we can play around with this. Because if I can get that probe you know, closer to the fire and it's running 160 down closer to the fire, but up there at the grate, it's like, you know, 150, then that's perfect for that brisket to rest. So be looking for that video in the future. It's gonna come soon and uh, like real soon. I know I'm just rambling on here, but this thing excites me. It's gonna be pretty sweet. And I've got a lot more brand new things that I'm gonna be revealing, that I'm gonna be showing here in the next couple weeks. So barbecue's your thing. Like this video, because I need that like. Subscribe so you will see the next ones and hit the bell so that you don't miss anything because you'll get the notification. Hey, that dude over there on Dream It Make It has a new video out. I should probably go watch it. And uh, it'll be there for you. So like, subscribe, hit the bell, and get outside and make some crazy good barbecue.